we were hardened soldiers. We had seen a lot of people. We've seen people die. We've seen people wounded and everything. But when we saw that, we could not understand. So we were supposed to go into Munich. That was a place, the last place where we were going to go. And at that time, at that point, a lot of the buildings had been bombed out and stuff. And so there weren't a whole lot of big battles, but there were from time to time, you know. But they told our commander there, he was at this point in time, he was a colonel. And they said, uh, Colonel Sparks, you know, take a turn and go down there and see what's going on down at that cop. And what we saw is things we'll never forget. So the first thing that had to be done before we got in there, we had to take out those towers. They had four t big towers with machine gunners up in top. And then inside the camp, which was run by Heinrich Himmler, uh, he had left and he took a lot of the SS men with them, but he left a lot of guards there. There was like 57 guards at one time that were lined up. So when our people got inside, we weren't allowed to give them any food to eat. They were so undernourished that would have killed them. We could give them cigarettes and we could give them candy, but uh, no food. So the guys that we saw were just uh, stripped down. Some were naked. There were men, women, children. There were over 2,000 bodies on those rail cars that were being, being ready either to go into the uh, place in the ovens there to get cremated with the other ones. Some, we saw the gas chamber, things like that, terrible. And uh, like I say, a uh, couple of things happened. Uh, whenever people saw that, a lot of the guys cried. They started crying, a lot of them vomited. And many of us did both, because we never, never saw anything like that. Could imagine human beings treating somebody else that badly, you know. When we liberated that place, there were 31,000 at that camp at that time, that point in time. But uh, that's, that was a terrible place. Every once in a while, if I think about it, I can get that smell up on my nostrils. It's something, you, it never leaves you, that, that burning flesh. Uh, you, you never forget about that.